My name is Rachel Hout. I'm the city's chief digital officer, and my goal is to realize New York City's digital potential as a leading digital city across the areas of infrastructure, education, open data, engagement, and industry. I'm very honored to be here at Engadget Expand because the event itself really reflects the growth of technology in New York City, the fact that so many people are coming here to celebrate innovation, and really celebrates New York City as a hub for innovation, whether it's wearable electronics or 3D printing, where we're fast becoming the 3D printing capital of the world. New York City really is in the midst of a tech golden age, and it's great to see that all visibly on display. The foundation of New York City's digital strategy is access, and we define that as access for all New Yorkers, regardless of income level, regardless of the resources that you may have in your household. Libraries play a very critical role in this. Schools do as well. Recreation centers run by the city's parks departments. And we've even invested in senior centers where we are connecting more and more senior citizens with the internet and providing training. It is absolutely critical that we expand Wi-Fi and cell service to the subways. Today, you can get access in 36 underground subway stations, but the plan is to expand that to all 277 underground stations. So far, that's been done through a combination of contracts that the MTA has, as well as sponsorships with certain partners such as Google and Microsoft and HTC. Making sure that more young people know how to code is paramount. And not only are we looking at this for younger students through things like our Digital Ready Literacy Program and through very exciting programs like the Academy for Software Engineering, we're also investing in programs that support uh, continuing education opportunities. So we have a web development internship that is provided free of charge with Flatiron School. New York City is a completely unique destination and presents completely unique opportunities to any entrepreneur. Some of the reasons why we hear that people come here is first and foremost because of its diversity. You look at a lot of other tech hubs and it's sort of a one industry town and in some ways it ends up being an echo chamber or, or a bit of a bubble. In New York City you're always kept humble because there are so many major industries and you're always intersecting with them and I think that pr provides and, and enables enormous creativity and enormous collaboration. The advertising industry incredibly powerful here. Retail and fashion, the media sector is incredibly strong. So this enables all kinds of partnerships and it's also the reason why companies that perhaps weren't started in New York City are quickly expanding here. Just last year there were more than $8.3 billion worth of acquisitions in New York City's tech sector. Already we're off to a great start this year with a billion dollar acquisition of Tumblr and MakerBot, of course, also having a very, very strong exit. So we're seeing this and we think we're really only at the beginning and the future looks very bright.